G'day everyone, Andrew here from Property Association. So we just wanted to do a really short video in terms of how Corona started to already impact the market, how far we can see it going and when we can see a recovery and what we can do to actually be prepared to try and minimise the impact in terms of what's going on. So the first thing that we want to talk about is obviously everyone started to change their marketing, doing one-on-one um, -on -one appointments, doing online inspections and so forth. But what, what does it mean for our market? It means that at the moment, we're finding that new inquiries and activities are really dropping quite sharply. So uh, we, we had said it a few weeks ago, everybody who had finance approval, who was looking for the last month or so, they're committed to, to finishing off their transactions and they're okay. But talking to other agents, uh, financial planners, brokers, what they're saying is, anyone that's walked through the doors in the last two weeks, they're pulling right back. You know, they're not, we're getting questions such as, what happens if I exchange and everything then freezes? Uh, what happens if I can't get a removal list? So these are the concerns out there that people are thinking and it's really getting them to, to the pull back. And I think we can see that we're, we're heading towards a full lockdown in the next two weeks. So um, all we can then start to do is be really prepared to take advantage of when, when we get some normality back into the marketplace. Feedback we've had this year, we can see that investors were starting to come back. So 2018, 2019 were definitely the years of the first home buyers. But we could see that from the beginning of this year that you've had more and more investors starting to, to get interested in the property market. And with what's happened you know, with the share market, they're, they're there, they are there, they're just not willing to pull the trigger yet. So what we need to do and what you need to do in the industry is be ready. Do all the hard work now, don't get demotivated, keep pushing through and be ready because what's gonna happen is at some point in time, we're gonna start to ease back these restrictions. So we've still got a couple of restrictions to come, but at some point, I'm going to ease back and say, hey, you can now be in groups of 50. And those investors are going to see that as the first sign of coming back to some normality and they're going to pull the trigger. So you've got to be able to take advantage of that. So you've got to do everything right between now and then to be in that position to capture those buyers. Moving forward for that, we still see some issues in terms of people going back to work, but then not having the work history for the banks to necessarily feel comfortable in giving them funding. They might be starting new jobs, still on probation periods, all these things that might make it a little bit harder for them to access funds straight away, but it will start to ease. So we think over the next 18 months, there's gonna be periodic opportunities where you can definitely jump in and, and, and capitalize on people's um, rising optimism in terms of the general economy and market, and then we're gonna find that normality, then we're gonna find that stability again and continue as business um, as usual. So we're always here to help. Give us a buzz, let's have a chat, let's bounce some ideas because we always learn when we do that. Thanks.